Hi there, I'm Miss Brownlee and I'm the History teacher at JAS and I wanted to talk to you a little bit about the A-level programme that we're going to be running next year for History. Uh, we're going to be following the Edexcel um, exam board and through Edexcel we're going to be looking at the topics of Britain transformed from 1918 to 1997, so it's a massive time period that we're going to be looking at. And then we move uh, to the other side of the world, to the USA, looking at boom bust recovery, looking from about the 1920s to 1955, so if you've done um, IGCSE history you would have covered the USA topic so that's kind of going through a lot of things that you might already know and then adding some more new information so you've got a concrete kind of understanding before we move on to A level and then for part three we're going to be looking at the witch craze in Britain and Europe looking at the time periods of 1580 to 1750 which will be extremely exciting and something very very new and very different Okay, so for the AS and A-level scheme, there's paper one and paper two. Paper one is a breadth study, which is 30% of your A-level and 60% of your AS level. Then we move into paper two, which is 20% of your A-level and 40% of your AS level. So both exams are, what paper one is an 2 hours and 50 minutes, and then paper two is an hour and 30 minutes, and that's done. And then if you take that as an AS level, that's done, packaged away. And then if you move into A level only, you'll have a third paper, which is paper three, and that's looking at themes and in depth, kind of looking at aspects in depth, looking at how we can draw parallels between the other two papers. And then that counts for 30% of your A level, and that's two hours. Uh, for your coursework, which will be 20% of your overall grade for history, you will be looking at an independently researched topic. That's something that you think is extremely interesting in history. It might be something completely disconnected to our course. Um, and that's something that I'll help you with and be able to foster that growth. And essentially, it's looking at creating a 3,000 to 4,000 word essay, looking at something to do with an investigative study on the topic that you choose.